Hello, hello, and welcome to our channel. It's very good to have you here. In today's video, we are going to have a look at how to inspect ignition coil. The ignition coil basically has two windings. There is a primary winding and there is a secondary winding. The primary winding will begin at the positive terminal. Positive is marked on the upper side. If you can see clearly, there is a positive market on the top of the ignition coil, or sometimes it is named as terminal 50. Right here, you see there is a positive mark and uh, it is also known as terminal 15. The center terminal is called terminal 4 and the other terminal is called terminal 1 or the negative terminal of the ignition coil. So both the primary winding and the secondary winding will begin at the positive terminal. Secondary will come out at terminal 4 or center terminal and the other end of the primary winding will go to the negative terminal. So in order to test the ignition coil well-being, place your multimeter on resistance value such a fashion then once resistance is selected measure resistance value between the positive and the negative terminal to see the primary winding and between the center and the positive to see the secondary winding let's go ahead and do that right here we are measuring now the resistance value of the primary it is reading 3.5 ohm and in order to test the secondary place one multimeter on the positive and place the other on the center terminal that will measure the secondary winding now we are finding 9.6 kilo ohm this is how you can test the primary winding and the secondary winding of your ignition coil for this ignition coil right here we have the positive terminal from the positive to the negative you will find the primary it is reading 4 ohms and go ahead and measure it to the secondary winding we are finding 8.4 thousand 8.47 kilo ohm that is very nice and for this ignition coil also you can do the same test place one multimeter on the positive terminal the other on the negative it is reading 3.4 ohm place it in here it is reading 7.48 kilo ohm then once the values are found all you have to do is compare it to the specification of your ignition coil if you find infinity between the positive and the negative terminal it indicates this coil the primary winding is open circuit if you find very small resistance close to zero, it means the primary winding is shorted out. Similarly, if you find no continuity between the positive and the ignition coil center terminal, it indicates the secondary wind is open. If you find a very small value between the positive and the ignition coil center terminal, that indicates the ignition secondary winding is, winding is shorted out. This is how you can inspect ignition coil of your vehicle. 